definitely I'm I'm excited to be here I'm excited to fight uh, we got here yesterday had a pretty much a full day of you know check-ins getting our rebuck kit getting the fight kit today we have some media and do do the big like um, you know video shoot photo shoot I've got open workouts and uh, I don't know we're just enjoying the process having fun and just grateful to be here I was gonna say, I mean, without pushing today we have some media and do do the big like um, you know video shoot photo shoot I've got open workouts and uh, I don't know we're just enjoying the process having fun and just grateful to be here yeah. you eating that? I am yeah oh, sure. so no, no no I'm I you Tyler Mittenden. Is that you? <laughs> that is Tyler. Is that you? Yeah. yeah. So he's a nutritionist. <laughs> You're a nutritionist? Yes. He doesn't look like much, but he's Combat actually pretty stars. good at what he does. <laughs> I know it doesn't look like. They say we're the best. I don't care what they say. It's good. Our team of total people. Um, we have a whole team out here. We have Yo Romero. We have Phil Dos Santos. No. We have Megan. Um, and Anthony Smith and Alistair Overing. So we got you know, George Lockhart Five. and we got a whole entire team of, of, of guys out here cooking, sending meals, uh, handling weight cuts. Oh God! <laughs> I'm the director of rehabilitation at the UFC Performance Institute. Um, I was hired a year ago to kind of work with our athletes, make sure that they go into their fights as healthy as possible. So today with Megan we're going to do some flushing, some soft tissue work, make sure her mobility is really good throughout her legs and shoulders so that she can get the maximum benefit and feel the best going into the octagon. So my background is that I used to work at the United States Olympic Committee. So I worked at the training center in Colorado Springs and worked on athletes every day for rehabilitations or just maintenance. The biggest difference now working with these athletes from the UFC is they're not used to getting that maintenance treatment. So, you know, if something's stiff or tight, they usually just push through it. Now they can come in and they have a medical provider that they can say, hey, can we work on this and get this fixed so they can train at their best ability? And that's a huge difference because normally PTs and stuff are looked at from pain, injuries, things like that. But where medicine and where sports are going, it's taking it to the next level where they can actually go into everyday training, training the right way, training the right muscles, making sure that there's no injuries that are going to occur and do a lot of preventative stuff. Is that me or you? So fight week, it's kind of different for everybody. I think that uh, you know, I, I've I've been through the the week as a fighter. I've been through the week as a as a coach, and I, I think really it's it's pretty much just about kind of maintenance, really, and all the work's done, the hard work. It's about getting your weight, uh, your weight down, and then uh, just feeling confident. You know, having fun, feeling confident, and I really, uh, I, I emphasize uh, embracing the moment, embracing the journey, having fun, uh, appreciating the process here. All right, take this. We've been working towards this, and I've pictured this for so long, and I'm like, like this is where I, this is where I'm meant to be. So it's not like. Oh my God, I'm here. It's just like, okay, well, like it's time to get started. It's almost like I feel, I feel like it's a, it's a new beginning. No, it's just we've trained so much for this that we're just like, there's nothing else, you know, mentally, physically, emotionally, like there's nothing else, there's no stone that we left unturned preparing for this and I know whatever happens, you know. You know, we see getting our hand raised. <laughs> 